goat's back in the long drive. <laughs> Sorry, excuse me. I just drank something and it kind of got out of control. There's a poo working like a like a police light on my car. Look at this. Uh, so it's Christmas Day that I'm recording this, so we're going to see how this goes. Um, I currently have no radiator. So hopefully we can roll down this hill and figure out what's going on. What are you doing? Come here. All right, well, that didn't work. Oh, there's a rabbit right there. Well, we better get moving. Uh, we got to drive 50 kilometers or more, as per always. Uh, we're going to drag this down, I think. Is that is that right? Yeah, okay, here we go. We're missing half of what we need to make the car go, but that's okay. We got poos everywhere for some reason. Giant tires. See if we just can't pull back on the road here. I'm hoping to find some kind of building here in a relatively quick time. Now, the car has cooled off. Uh, what, what did that hit? Okay. Um, I'm not sure what's going on. Dude, I'm going a little faster, and you're going to have to get out of the way. All right, let's, uh, let's go around you. Excuse me. There we go. Let's keep up this little bit of speed here. Hopefully we can find a radiator at some point, because we're not going to get very far without one. Not today, anyway. But it'll be a nice, quiet journey at the beginning. Oh, what do we got here? What do we got here? This could work. Well, sometimes there's radiators here. Let's, uh, let's check it out. See if there's anything worth stopping for. It's going to be a waste of our momentum, but I guess we'll find out. Okay, let's uh, stop right here a little bit on the hill. Let's get out of the car and take a look. Okay, this clear my throat business is getting out of control. Sometimes you'll find a radiator here, but this is not the case this time. No, not the case this time. Maybe it's on the roof. Can't get on the roof from here. I might go on the roof from here. There goes a perfectly non-radiated car going by there. Nothing up here. There's a bus. Um, hey, bus. What's going on, bud? All right. Let's see here. Lights on, please. Or light on, I should say. All right. Let's continue rolling down this hill for a while. Until we come across something that may contain a radiator. <laughs> or we have to turn on the car. There's that, too. All right. Well, let's keep going here. We'll see what's, see what's going on. At some point, we're going to have to climb a hill, and the car's going to, like, overheat. Oh, no. Goodness sakes. Oh, that's just a tire. Okay, we're fine. That's fine. All right, let's see here. All right, so, at, like I said, at some point, we're going to be going uphill, uh, and rolling just is not going to cut it. <laughs> so, we definitely need to find a radiator or something. And we may be stealing it from another car, for all we know. At least temporarily, anyway. Okay, that was a rock. I didn't even see that. Okay, this is very, very easy. Okay, okay, this is so fast. We're just rolling. Good lord, this thing handles bad with these big wheels on it. Like all the cars do when you mismatch wheels like this. Okay, just careful. Yeah, it's just all over the place. Oh, there it goes. Oh, I can't see what I'm going to hit. Okay, <laughs> there we go. Okay. No, no, turn turn the engine off. Once I get back on the road, turn it off. We, don't, we need to save the engine for the moments we actually need it. Okay, here we go. Oh, this is going to be a long one. I can feel it. In my, I can feel my bones. But books has been gone all day, so it's, you know, it's a no no pants Christmas uh, up here in Scapegoat's house. So that's nice. <laughs> no pants Christmas. Come hang out with me in Rob Lotion. Where, 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 where? Oh, there's a couple of rocks right here. This ain't no good. That is not funky, funky fresh right there. Okay. There's a water tower off to my left here. You can kind of see it kicking around. Um, there won't be anything there. 
I guess I can get all four big tires for this thing, but geez, that would be so bad. Oh, right, here we go. So for just rolling, we're not doing too bad. We only need to use the engine once to get us back on the road, and that wasn't so bad. So we only ran it for about, and actually accidentally turned it on. I didn't mean to turn it on. Oh God, okay, stay on the road, bud. Okay, okay, I think we're getting on a flat spot here. Oh, nice, okay. Come on. Oh God, rock, okay. Yeah, these things will get rolling like real fast on a hill. <laughs> you got to be super careful with them when they're just rolling. A lot of times you'll exceed what the engine can do just by rolling. Son of a gun, it is flattening out and there is not a place. There's a devil or devil road. Take me home to the place I belong. I see a car in front of me. It's kind of stupid. Get out the way, stupid car. Do I have my high beams on? I do not. There we go. How is this still rolling? Like, is this is this downhill? Like, even in the slightest? Like, is that what is that why it's still rolling? Because I feel like it shouldn't be rolling anymore. <laughs> Yet here we are. Just a gradual slope. Okay, yeah, now we're slowing down. Let me see. Maybe it's because the car's on an angle. It has its own slope. But it just, does anybody feel like it's going to take it an excessive amount of time to uh, slow down? Okay, the bus is going to hit me in the back here if I don't uh, use some discretionary speed. Oh. Is there no lights? On? Oh, we got to turn the ignition on to see that. There we go. Nine kilometers, though. Not bad. <laughs> I'm mostly rolling. All right, let's kick the gas in. Looks like we're coming to a little uh, little stop here. We'll take a, take a peek. It's a great way to save fuel <laughs> for anybody who's interested in just, just rolling along. There we go. All right, let's just step out and take a look. Oh God, it's so dark here. A wheel, a wiener. Wheel of wieners. I can't figure out where, I'm just gonna. Attach out like this. Okay, cause I can't see otherwise. Alcohol. I feel like there's something going on down there. It's very noisy. Is there a... Ah, here it is. Okay, perfect. A little side lighting for when we need it. All right, here we go. Oh, there's a car stuck on the road here. I want to find a legitimate radiator so I don't have to have it stolen back at the beginning of the next episode. Great, now I have something... That new wiener's causing a problem. Listen, new wiener, I don't got time for your crap. Okay, there we go. All right, let's uh, let's assess. Ignition off, please. I don't hear any ticking. Yeah, shut up, Robert. We're busy. Maybe because it's nighttime, it's not heating up as much. Oh, here comes the daylight. 
Yeah, maybe you can run without a radiator at night because of it's so cold out. Excuse me. Coming through. I still can't believe I've gone this long without finding a radiator. Like, that's nuts. Oh, I see you up there, little uh, little car, trying to cause me some trouble. Yeah, it makes me angry. <laughs> All these cars I can't steal from for fear they'll steal their parts back. There we go, gain a little bit of extra speed, turn the engine down before she overheats. What is happening here? What what is what was this? Oh no. Is that a storm? It looks like we may have something coming up over here. It'd be nice to get to whatever that is. Let's keep an eye on it. Because at this point, anything's better than what we got. Where'd it go? Okay, we got a bunker coming up. Sometimes they have radiators, but not often. There, now the engine's ticking. Oh, jeez, this is... It's awkward being in this sandstorm. Oh my god, the wind is very strong in here. I've never... Stuff blows away? My meat! Well, okay, I don't think we should probably get out here until the sandstorm, like, passes or something. The, bed, the bed's moving around upstairs. <laughs> okay, ignition off. I need this thing to cool off. Okay, we're gonna go inside. Hopefully not get blown away. Okay, here we go. Okay, that's a little better. That's a little better. Oh, here we go. A little, little chocolate for the guy. Okay, here we go. Oh, is it on the doors? Is this what's happening? Okay, there we go. What do you have in you? Any treats? Nothing. But we do have water here, which we can drink from. Oh, that's better. Okay. Now we don't have to worry about that so much. Okay. There we go. All right. Just stop the water so we don't waste it. In case we decide to do a return trip, there's still water. Right? Nothing here. Man, that sandstorm was kind of scary. It wasn't scary last time. Still no radiator, though. Looks like there may have been a major accident up there. We may be able to take advantage of the situation a little bit. Depending on what crashed. Oh, it's a Dasha. No, you don't. Figured it out for you, you're good. There we go, thank you. I just need to borrow this for a little bit. The second I can swap up, that's what we'll do. Thanks, bud. Mwah. Okay, here we go. Stolen radiator, just us in the road, let's go. <laughs> there we go, it's not full of fluid, but like I said, I'm not planning on keeping it, so. Should do enough of a cooling job right now. Perfect, okay. We've gotten 16 kilometers already. It's not bad. I think we're about 15, you know, a kilometer a minute for not having a radiator, not bad. Okay, let's see here. Now, hopefully that wiener doesn't cause me some massive issues here, because they like to. Oh, 
Jones is very, very off-road fast. There's two types of fast in this game. There's fast and off-road fast. Off-road fast, much more dangerous because the ground texture and shape can change at any time. But the road, you can be fast, but there's more oddly easier to hit an obstacle on the road because you're stuck within a predefined space. So if you really, 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 really want to go fast, really you should do it off-road, like on, on this, because it's probably safer. Might get the odd jump or something. I just got a message from Books. It tells me she's on her way home. So hopefully I get this wrapped up before she gets here, because I need to go put on pants before she shows up. So now we're against the clock, boys. <laughs> we are against the clock. Whoa. Okay, that was that was close. All right, this is good. We're going really freaking fast here. All right, here we go. Doesn't mean I don't want to stop places, because we do need to find our own radiator. But it does mean we'll probably be skipping that double building, because double buildings are terrible. But there's a house up here we might be able to get a radiator at, and that's lovely. But every time I was missing my radiator last time I stopped at one of these houses, it was like a Tremont, which does not have radiator. It's like the game triggers something, like, oh, he doesn't have a radiator? Make sure you only give him Trabants from this point forward. Okay. Probably start slowing down now. Oh, goodness sakes. Okay, we're going backwards. Not a problem. And side slip. Okay, perfect. Alright, here we go. Deja vu. <laughs> in this place before. Yeah, of course, no cars, right? Let's see what we got. Um, we got whatever this, this is a roof or, so, or a hood from something. There's always this bed covering this area. Okay, let's see here. We got one human arm. They are eating a bun before they bought it. They had road lotion and a bun. You know where that was going. Okay, we got this. We got... They got what, what did I just knock over? A bucket? Looks like there may be a jerry can on the roof. Boop, 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 boop. Okay, you yeah, know what you do. You get up here. People are always like, roll the mouse wheel. No, that's not how you do it. That is not. You can do it that way, but it's more fun to challenge yourself to the pounding of the <laughs> the button. No, I'm not going to do it today. Let's see. Nothing good here. It's got this door, which we don't, <laughs> we don't need this door. All right, let's get out of here. 22, not bad, not bad, here we go. Oh, it's just an oil container. Nothing to write home about. Excellent, okay. So I hope everybody had a Merry Christmas, you know. It's one of those seasons that you hope everybody gets time to spend with family and friends. Even if you don't celebrate Christmas, it's nice to have the holiday around to, you know, like, celebrate. Oh, goodness sakes, oh crap. Get out of the way that thing hit, there we go, that's fine, we're good. Perfect. A little, little mishap, but we're back on the road. We're all right. Can't have that happening. <laughs> this is good. We got enough food in us to last for a little bit. We got enough water in us to last for a little bit. Our poop and pee aren't too full. We got a radiator. It doesn't belong to us, but we got one. We got a turbo, which doesn't belong to us, but we got one. And, uh, yeah, everything's going great. Whoa, okay. <laughs> Okay, that's not good. Oh! Put the parking brake on. <laughs> okay. Let me out of here, all right. Like, everything fell out except the, uh, the radiator. <laughs> okay. Oh, I gotta put the one bus wheel back on the back here. All right, here we go. Boom. All right, we gotta go grab this front tire. Uh, it's gonna be a day. It's gonna be a day. Get that back on there. Surprised the tailgate didn't fall off. It falls off at the drop of a hat. This thing is so weirdly impossible to control. <laughs> There we go. Okay, so what I want to do, actually, is this one seemed to be causing some trouble, so I want to put it here, maybe. All right, here we go. 
A little bloody. That's okay. You gotta be a little careful next time. There we go. Come on, baby. Now, I've noticed the road kind of curls back on itself here coming up. Does it make more sense just to cross the desert and forget about it? I was still got that wiener still causing problems. This may be one of those save the game moments, you know, where you can save it and correct the problem. Because look, the road comes out down here, so why would I go around the bend other than to avoid obstacles, I guess? Seems kind of seems kind of pointless. <laughs> we'll save a little bit of distance here across the desert. Perfect. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. Here we go. We don't want to run into anything. This is going well. Okay. We should probably check how far we've come now. 26. Okay. A little bloody, but that's okay. Um. Hopefully we got something. Oh, that looks like something maybe coming up here. The road is really kinky here. <laughs> I don't understand why it's doing this, but sure. All right, let's go. Hopefully that banging around wiener there is not going to cause too much trouble. You can hear that turbo spin up like a jet turbine, eh? It's like... Doo. It's funny. Okay. Now, if again, if I cross the, the desert here, I don't think it's that big of a deal because... The road just wraps around this way anyway. And we got a double building coming up, which sometimes contains spray, which we kind of need right now to fix up our uh, our dashboard. So all things considered, it's not going that badly. We don't want to hit any big rocks, or small rocks for that matter, but okay. Across the road here. Okay, that's that's definitely not on the road. Okay, um... We may be going over there to stop anyway. You know what? We're gonna go over there. Let's go over there. So the truck's turning on its own right now. I'm not even doing anything. And... straighten itself out. Okay, there we go. Those two big rear tires. So the road's back over that way? Okay. All right, well, looks like we got some parts falling out of the sky, so that's a good sign. So the road should be back over that way, I think it said it was. Yes, so we're back over that way. All right, ignition off. Let's see, what are we at? 31. Not the worst. Bam, gonna get this, okay. What we got, oh no. Okay, so far, not a whole lot on the bottom floor. All right, let's go check upstairs. Not much going on here. Hatch lid, bed, no, oh geez, this is very wobbly, okay. We'll go up another floor and see what's going on. Oop, there we go. Uh, Mother-in-law door. Yep, okay. Yep, okay. Uh, uh. What's that? Let me know what that is. Let's go check the top here. Nothing, okay. So we're gonna jump from here to here. Whoa, okay, there we go. Let's see what this is. You're a jerry can with a little bit of gas. Ooh, ah. Not exactly what I was looking for, but, you know, whatever. Dude, dude, pick this up. Okay, here we go. Flying down here. Okay, there we are. Let's open this gas cap back up. Done. Okay. Back to the road, I guess. All right, here we go. But I still haven't found what I'm looking for. Oh. <laughs> Oh, here we go. I'm gonna make this make this turn here. Man. So I feel like we're gonna start the next episode without a radiator again from the way things are going. 
Because that dude's gonna steal back his radiator and we're gonna be radiator less. But that's all right, I guess. Is that like the worst thing not to have a radiator? I can think of like, not having wheels is much more of an issue, so. And I've lost wheels several times. I had to drag this thing around by its, its bits, so. Like carrying spare wheels would be great, but there's no way to tie them down, really. So you can't really like, like, like stick them in place. Like I guess if you can get them in one of the baskets, it might be able to hold them down. But then how many spares do you carry? Like one, two? Because you'd want at least two. Because sometimes you lose two wheels, and that, that happens. But at least one, and then you got to figure out what. Like it'd be nice to have. Um, like a, a, a mountable spare, like on the vehicles. Like, I don't know about these trucks, but on a lot of trucks, it's underneath the, the box, the mountable tire. On uh, the cars, it's under the rear trunk floor mat. I believe some cars had it under the hood, like where the engine is, on some older, smaller cars. Uh, but it would be nice to have the spare like locked down. Oh no, there's a rock right there. Oh no, come on baby, don't don't go out of control now, fool. Like we have time for this. Dun, dun. Oh god! Oh another coat of paint and she would have had me, baby. Alright, let's see. There's a nice little tiny little gas station coming up here. Well sorry bud. Didn't mean to cut you off there. And we are in. Okay. Perfect, okay. Okay, we got a poop, we got a wheel. Oh, we got one good wheel. Oh, we got, is this another good wheel? These aren't bad wheels, boys. I think we may be swapping out. Ah. No more bus tired crazy truck. All right, no, now what's tipping and falling out? Okay, get out of here. Oh my God, that is so much better. Okay. We had some fluids, what's this? There we go. Boy, we're getting close to filling this tank up for the first time in a while. Okay, let's see. What are you? Your magazine that has less than a sponge. Oh, c'est un sponge. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Makes the blood go away. There we go. Oh, and your sponge is done. You've served your purpose, sponge. I have a little nap right here. Now, normally I'd sleep drive at this point, but. We're not moving, so we're just gonna nap here. Now that we have a regular wheeled truck, maybe it'll handle a little better. I saw a rabbit. Okay, 36 in. Let's uh let's get this let's get this done. Now we have real wheels. Re real rear real weird. Okay. Real wheels. Thank you. My god, why is that so hard to say for me? Uh oh. Do we have a a crash bang boom truck right now? Yeah, we definitely have a crash bang boom truck. So all sorts of bad may happen because of this crash bang boom. Oh, a little easier to control. I like that. I like that a lot. There we go. Blow off valve just singing its little tune. Okay. That reminds me of blow off valves like that are so early 2000s. It reminds me of like a dial up modem tones, like that sound. But like the car guy version, like, yeah, remember when blow off valves were so loud like that? Like on street cars, like people have like a regular, like everyday turbo that didn't even really require that type of wastegate functionality. Like, <laughs> you'd be like, <laughs> oh, fools. What a waste of money. Spend your money on stuff that matters. Now there is a, there's a use case for them. Don't get me wrong. It's just a lot of people who had them did not need them and they don't need to be that obnoxiously loud. All oh, right, but I'm also the guy that's like against uh, like removing catalytic converters and stuff because I don't see the point. Like on modern catalytic converters, for example, like they did tests on this and like horsepower loss is like two, which could just be in the noise. So like, I don't know, it doesn't seem worth it to me. But you know, if you want your car to smell terrible, go right ahead. <laughs> I guess it's like. 
Modern cats are great, you know, and it protects the environment from harmful stuff. And, you know, regardless if you want to argue with climate change, I'm not talking about that. We know for an absolute fact there's terribly harmful stuff in, in car exhaust when it's not filtered through a, uh, uh, a catalytic converter. You can go look this up. This, is, this, has been, this has been known for 40, 50 years now. That if you can burn some of that stuff up, you get less of a problem. Still, you know, CO2, but I'm saying... Check it out. I'm not making it up. And then the car just stinks. And you come out and you smell like it, you know? Like, I don't want to go to, like, pick up a date and be like, Oh, God! <laughs> well, that either. <laughs> I don't want to go to, like, pick up a date. And, like, you're... Uh, you just reek of, like, raw gasoline. No, nah, thanks. Oh, God, I'm hungry. Why am I hungry? Oh, no. Okay, well, you know what, actually? Maybe we can eat that silly wiener there. Let's get off the road here. All right. Where are we at? 42, not bad. All right, let's, uh, which one was it? Did, was it this one I was hanging that was acting, acting a fool? Get out of here. Nobody wants, nobody wants your bits anymore. Come on, you gotta poop at least once. Come on. Poop before we go. Oh, there we go. Perfect. I can't believe that, that worked out so well there when I hit that rock. Yeah, and they come to the herd and say, oh no! <laughs> If you ever go to a date and you show up at their door and your first reaction is, oh no, I want to hear about this in the comments. Put this in the comments. I want to talk about this. This is funny. I've only ever had one such moment, but it wasn't a date. Oh, it was not a date, but it was uh, one such moment where I went somewhere and I was like, dear Lord, this is not, this is not what I signed up for today. Oh, good times. <laughs> okay. Oh, oh, oh no. I've, oh, oh, okay. The car's, getting, the car's getting a little bit squirrely at these Devil Road. Devil Road. Okay. Just be, be careful, guy. <laughs> just... Guy. All right. Just, 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 just relax, bud. We don't have too much further to go. And you're... Okay. Keep the drift going. Okay. All right. Here we are. Okay. This is, this is more drifting. That's fine. All right. All right. We're getting there. We're getting there. All right. Here we go. Check for internal distances. 45. All right, not bad, not bad. We're getting there. We're just about there. And you guys don't have to tolerate me anymore on your Christmas Day. Well, you're not going to see this until Boxing Day morning, but it's not the point. Okay, we got one little stop here, and then we should be good. And again, maybe we, hopefully we can find a radiator, maybe. I thought I saw something fall through the world, but I almost drove through the world one day. Okay, here we go. Okay, let's see what our internal investigation has said. 46. Now, this radiator is getting a bit low on water, but it hasn't changed since I installed it, so I'm not super concerned. Okay, let's see. What is that? What is that? Oh, railroad tight. All right. Ooh, lots of boxes. Lots of guns. There's a little bit of oil, which we haven't checked that in a while either. Man, we're just getting really lazy with our fluids, aren't we? Okay. Got some more wiener up here. We don't want that. All right, we're good. And back in the car. On this, go. How far do we have to go? Four kilometers. We can do that with our with our hands tied behind our back. All right. Hi, bud. Gonna squeeze through here. Perfect. Okay. So this is another road I can just cross the desert for. Why are you being so bendy, road? Unnecessarily, even. really hear that turbo spooling up, eh? <laughs> oh, it may bottom out here and flip the car. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, we, we got to be close to the proper distance here now. Let me just line this up with nothing for just a moment so we can check. Yeah, 48, okay. This should get us back to the road. Was that a car? Oh, yes, it was a car. Look at that. Oh, around this little bit. 48.6. Not bad. All right, so we're back on the road here. Now, of course, we want to pull off the road for when we stop. Because if we don't, uh, some car is going to hit us or some stupid crap. Next <laughs> time we play the game. So we got to be very aware of that fact, baby. 
There's a rock looking at me from the side of the road. He said, get to the love shack. No, he didn't. The rocks don't talk often. Depends how much I've had to drink. Now. Okay, we're gonna get a little, little turbo action there. Okay, that, that, this is a bouncy devil road. The worst kind of devil roads. Okay, here we go. Let's see. Oh, 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 oh. God, it's making me motion sick. All right, here we go. 98, 99, and... Oh, we're just gonna just gonna cruise along. Sorry, bud, but it's gonna keep going. Sorry. And and fitty. Okay, there we go. Ignition off. Thank you. I'm out of the car. Well, not bad. Let's check the oil. What's the oil level at? Ah, oh, it's not great. Look at this guy over here doing stuff. Anyway, I'm gonna end this episode here. So, thank you so much for watching. If you like this, please leave a comment. Maybe subscribe. Maybe tell your friends to subscribe. Maybe get your dog to subscribe. Maybe get your horse to subscribe. Santa subscribed last night. Only cost me milk and cookies. And if you didn't like this, well, you should probably find yourself a real YouTuber because I'm not much of one. Merry Christmas. Happy holidays. All the things. Love from Scapegoat. Thanks for a wonderful year. Out.